Right, just a quick short video update of the garden. Uh, you can see the clematis there has taken over the bird feeding station quite successfully. <laughs> it's quite good. I need to get out and cut the grass this afternoon because the trouble is we've had nothing but rain and it's grown. Um, and you just get it nearly dry enough to cut it and then it rains again. So yeah, that's uh, suffered a bit. Um, everything's grown, including the weeds. I'll try to pull back some of them. See, vegetable garden's doing well. We've got potatoes are nearly ready. Um, I have harvested one lot. I've now put some pak choy in their place. Uh, so that's those. You can see beans are growing there at the back. The cabbages are doing well. Loads of spuds this year. Absolutely, that was even in planters, look. And we've got uh, mint, basil, basil, a uh, whole ruck of tomato plants. Um, oh, God, that's a pumpkin, I think, if I remember rightly. So, the orange and the lemon are outside. I've cut the lemon back because that was getting really leggy. Um, most exciting bit, though, is the walnut tree. We appear to be getting little walnuts. Look at them. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be our first crop of walnuts this year. All right, it won't be a very big crop. But we've got a, got a crop of walnuts coming right in the greenhouse. What have we got in the greenhouse? Well, uh, I'm gonna try again growing aubergines. I've never had any success. Um, don't know what I'm doing wrong, but I'm going to try again this year. We will get aubergines eventually. Tomato plants are a bit leggy at the moment. Um, I've been feeding and watering them up, trying to get them to grow a bit more. This one's doing lovely. This is a purple tomato, this one. Uh, okay, black cherry. Uh, yeah, I'm hoping for good things from this, this year. Pepper plants. We've had a little bit of slug attack on some of them. Uh, I managed to get them away from the slugs and snails now. So yeah, we've got a good selection there. There's Chinese lanterns that Magpie planted. Uh, we didn't think they were going to come to much, and <laughs> they seem to be growing quite well now. Uh, more tomatoes, more peppers, tomatoes. Got loads more pepper plants coming up there. The insurance policy seedlings are doing really well, except that the labels, now I can't read what's on the labels, so I don't know which variety is in which row. Oh dearie me. <laughs> we'll find out when they start fruiting. Uh, same with the tomatoes. Someone forgot to label the tomatoes up, didn't I? And uh, again, when they start fruiting, we'll know what variety they are. So yeah, that's your little update on the garden. Actually, that was something unusual little find in the garden the other day when I was digging. God knows how long that's been there. But, look at that. Went with the Castle Hotel, Aubra on Sea. It looks like it's silver plated. Oh, let's flip it round. Yeah, bit of an interesting find. So, God knows how long it's been there, because this... The, where we are we're on the site of an old rectory gardens so whether it belonged to the gardener there at the time or whether it was part of the rectory somebody from the rectory borrowed it from the Wentworth Castle Hotel in Albra who knows <laughs> interesting though isn't it right that's your lot I'll catch you another time cheerio